Hi, everybody. Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Last break of the night, 2022 Panini Impeccable WWE. Last break of the night, last box of the case, last box ever. They're, they're no more <laughs> unless we produced ever again. Un unless we, we, might, we might get more, who knows. Um, but for now, big thanks to this group for making it happen. There are the numbers right there. Let's roll it and randomize it. One and a two, three times for names and numbers. One, two, and three. Got Chad down to Ryan after three. One and a two, three times for the numbers. One, two, and three. We got eight down to five. All right, so after three? Yes, after three. All right. So Chad with eight and two, Ryan with zero. So that's any and all redemptions that may or may not pop out of this final box. Um, and you'll get one of one redemption as well, but you've got that covered. You got number one. Joe P with nine, Chad Wright with seven, Tim with six, Joe with four, Oliver with three, and Ryan with five. Let's sort by number here. And I don't know, I'll keep the video running. Numbers usually don't get traded. So if you want to trade a number, speak now or forever hold your peace. We'll give it 30 seconds. Give it 30 seconds. We were talking a little football before. Damien saying if OSU isn't doing something with their wide receivers, they were doing something with edge rushers too. That's true. That's a very good point. Maybe, uh, maybe Ohio State is a good football program. They, uh, they, they are, I think. It's the same thing with, you know, Ohio State wide receivers and edge rushers and then Alabama QBs. Bryce Young may go number one, who knows? A lot of teams might be looking at looking at that QB class next year. That'll be good for the hobby next year too. All right, TWC trade one. Steve Steve's like Chris. Stop. Steve Herrick's not with you. On what? Bama QBs or on, on Mr. Pickett? Not sure. Probably about the uh, maybe both. Maybe both. I do say a lot of things that a lot of people have issue with. All right. Hey, that's that's part of the, the the extra layer of entertainment that we bring. This is the show, right? All right. For QB, he was Steve saying. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I mean, recently, the last few years. All right. So like here's the final printout. Hot off the presses. Thanks everyone for getting in. Appreciate you making this happen. Let's see if we got an extra case hit. No, just the metal card right here. But let's see what we have in here. Extra blanks. Let's see the plate first, and it's Alexa Bliss. Stainless Stars, 69 out of 99. So that goes to number nine, Joe P. All right, and now let's see. All right, now let's see what we got in here. Good luck, everybody. Keep your eye out on jazbeescasebreaks.com for more impeccable WWE. None that we can post now, but who knows? We may, we get, may get some more in the near future. Um, any other... Chris knows more about this stuff than I do, but Chris Jaspi, any more WWE coming up, like different product-wise? There's like Chronicles. an... Chronicles. Chronicles WWE. Chronicles WWE will be coming out in a few weeks, I think. I think mid-November. Okay. That sounds more like something you'd find on the Personal Breaks channel yes. instead of Group Breaks, but... Just check around, jaspies.com is where our personals are, at Jaspies Breaks on Instagram Live is where our group breaks are, or our personal breaks are, but check around. All right, we got our truth seven out of 35. That'll be for Chad Wright, number seven. We got Dana Brooke. 69 out of 99 for Joe Pizzle, the Dana Brooke. We have Aaliyah, 92 out of 99. Chad Wright with number two.
And then here comes our hit. We've got Dominic Mysterio. 85 out of 9. What do we, what do we have on Dominic Mysterio? You know Rey Mysterio? No, that's his son? That's his son. Wow. Who has become a very good bad guy. Everyone some, hates some him. Some sort of family affair. Hates Check that. That is 86 out of 99, by the way. It's sort of hard to see the numbers here against the pattern in the background. But that's for Tim and the number six. We have almost indelible ink autograph. 85 out of 99. That will be for Ryan Harold in the number five. Almost. What's his deal? He's big. Big. He's seven. Seven three. Yeah. And weighing it more than four hundred pounds on the back of the card. Humongous man. Ray Mysterio accidentally killed a guy by accident. Says Nick Jasper. <laughs> that did unfortunately happen. Yes, is no one's fault. It's Jeez. I did forget that happened though. Here's another big guy, Otis. Mm -hmm. Three out of ninety nine. Legit amateur wrestler. I think uh, qualified for an Olympic in 2012. And number three is for Oliver. Just the, the look you gave me when you said that <laughs> about the Rey Mysterio thing. I, I mean, like, I didn't know. I had to look yeah. for you for confirmation. Yeah, I, I didn't know if Nick was pulling ago, my leg. A few years ago in Mexico, yeah. We got Damien Priest, 14. Out of, did WWE just sweep that under the rug? Or just they, like, it didn't happen when he was there. It happened at a, a, when he was working at a show in Mexico. Oh. I think a AAA or CMLL. To the big Lucha, big Lucha Libre company. Alpha Lucha. Academy, says Oliver Soria. Yes. So he knows a thing or two. Wow. Oh, yeah, I, I didn't realize. Oliver know. did not know. Alpha Academy. 14 out of 99, Relic and Autograph, Damien Priest. What do we got on this guy? He's cool. Okay, he's cool. He's, uh, they have a lot of faith in him. They trust him to do stuff. Joe Pizzle, number Bad four. Bad Bunny. When Bad Bunny was wrestling, oh. he was his tag partner, yeah. All right, and the last one here is... I know this guy. Oh, brother. Let me tell you something, dude. 39 out of 84. Nice. Championship debuts. Hulk Hogan. I might go into a state of Hulkamania right now. It's running wild, Joe. Joe Pizzle, last spot mojo, number nine. Joe Pizzle with the 24 inch pythons. Ooh, Joe Pizzle. Joe Pizzle is going into a state of Hulkamania right now. <laughs> with, with the number nine, last spot mojo, last box, and who knows if we're getting any more. 70% of the time, Last Spot Mojo hits 100 times. Nick Jaspi in the chat, while we're uh, recording this video here, are we getting any more of this this week? You're welcome, Joe. Who knows? We might. Might not be at the same nice little price that we had, but maybe we'll get another case or two. Who knows? So keep an eye out on jaspiescasebreaks.com, and I'm sure there'll be some other WWE stuff coming up in the future. So there you go, gang. That was 2022 Panini Impeccable WWE one box, random number block break number 12. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com, and I'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.